Hey, this is John at Six String Country, and we're going to learn a song, Lonely East Texas Nights by Whiskey Myers. The song was written by Cody Cannon and the boys in Whiskey Myers. The song is in G, and it's going to feature a pretty easy strum pattern with some pretty fluid chords, as well as a lot of guitar work on the lead, a guitar solo as well. Let's get started. Uh, so just those four chords, simple strum pattern. Um, the intro of the song and the verses are going to be the same strum pattern or same chord pattern. Uh, it's an E minor seven, C two, to a D. So just E minor C D. Uh, and let's just put that in the context. So here's the beginning of the song. One, two, three, four. I'll play it slower with you. So that's going to be the intros and the verses. So moving into the turnarounds, coming right out of that, that verse progression, the lead guitar is going to come up and do a, um, some single notes on the high neck. Uh, we're gonna come in and do a, it's a C chord, to E minor, to D, and we're gonna hit that G over B chord we learned. C to D. So putting that in context, and there's two courses, and um, we're moving right out of that first course into another turnaround, which we just learned, um, going into the guitar solo. So coming out of that course, we got the guitar solo. There's gonna be two different types of uh, chord progressions. Um, the first half is going to be the E minor C D that we see in the verses. The second half is going to be it's going to be eight bars of of that first progression, and then it's going to be eight bars of C E minor D. Uh, so a chorus progression, if you will. Uh, strum pattern is going to be the exact same. So let's go ahead and grab it. Let's do uh, let's do the first eight. This is going to be the E minor C D, and the last eight are going to be. C, E minor, D. So one, two, three, four. There we are. So one more time. And here's a, here's a change of correct. Go to the C. Um, but let's go ahead and do the intro and verses. Let's put that to tempo. Here are the intro and verse progressions. Uh, one, two, three, four. Here are both of the turnarounds coming out of the first verse and one coming out of that first chorus. A one, two, three, four. So the uh, intro, we're going to start this song off. And 
And that's going to be kind of the main theme for, for the verses and the intros. So I'm just sliding there from the third fret to the fifth fret. I'm hitting the third fret E string there. It's really just a E minor, D, C, back to the D. Um, hitting the third fret B string, second fret E string. And do a C chord there, open G string, first fret B, open E string. And do just a kind of run of the mill D, D triad chord. And we'll do this twice. And then we're gonna come in and do a riff here in the um, uh, in the back half of the intro. And then we're into the verse there. So that back half of the intro. I'm going from the 10th fret B string to the 12th fret B string. So that's a guitar solo. Um, I'll break down what's kind of going on here. Uh, we'll start the 17th fret. So I'm hitting that 17th fret B string to the 15th fret E string. Then hitting that 17th fret E string. There you go. Do one bend, then we'll do a second bend, then we'll resolve it with a pull off. No, no, we're not gonna we're not gonna climb down the scale. Uh, that's what my fingers want to do. We're gonna actually uh, move on down to a different position. So what I'm doing there is doing a series of hammer-on pull-offs. <laughs> 